What is that called? It's like an antique manifold of pan. Read it so we don't Jesus. sound. Jesus! That is Good. shot. Okay, no, what I want to know is. Oh. Look right there. Oh, good. Okay, hold on real quick. Shine the light back up in between these. That is what it's kind of, sort of supposed to be shaped like. Not really. <laughs> that is awful. Do you even like know what that is? Yeah, it's ass. All right. Well, we. I've, it has been confirmed. It's ass. <laughs> Can we? That's uh, a bull crap. All right. So we are actually going to pick up on this tomorrow. We're going to do a little bit of work tonight just to kind of clean up and pull crap, getting all the tools back together and hardware. We just took off the rockers, the push rods, and we're about to take off the valve springs, but yeah. Be back with you guys here in a second. I'll give a quick update. Here's the rockers, push rods, I think I already showed you that. We're taking off the head bolts and the valve springs, and I'll set up a time lapse. Good lord, Hunter. You just gonna stick that whole bucket under there? I'm gonna stop the coolant with it. You need a bigger wall. Put this somewhere down there. Oh, see, we're tripping. Put this there. There? Right yeah. Good lord. Put these socks under the there. exhaust manifold bullshit. Where was that? So, what's your point? Where was I at? I was taking out a damn spark plug. I don't know why Hunter doesn't do this, but you can literally just get inside the car. Like this. It's not a fan. I don't know why, dude. This is comfortable. You put one foot down here on this radiator bracket. You put this foot. I feel like your dad's going to be angry that we licked one all over the place. We did not first time, so. Days six, seven, eight, somewhere through there, probably around seven. Um, I'm gonna give you a quick run up of what's going on, and then I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna try to do. But probably not gonna work, so let's go. So we guys give you give you guys a little step by step run up. We took off the intake manifold. That's what this thing is right here. It's your intake manifold, and under that, here's the valley pan. Just give you guys a quick run up. You guys probably already watched all this already. Um, after we did that, we took out the rockers, rocker bridges. We took out the push rods, took out the last spark plug we were missing. This is what we found in the uh, valley right here. Also took out the dipstick. The neighbors went on a random going outside spree, but it uh, looks like they're all over. I cleaned up a little bit while they are doing that. Rockers, rocker bridges. Here's all the sockets we've been using in this uh, spark plug. Let me, get, let me guys bring you up to date. So we are getting a new engine. So I'm pulling this out, I'm gonna like, see how much money I can get out of this. Uh, clean it up, trying to rebuild it. Never really re rebuilt the engine before. And if you talk to any car guys, 350s is like, 350 small blocks, like super common to rebuild. So it shouldn't be the most expensive rebuild ever. And it should be like a good learning pro process. But uh, we need to pull out the heads. And this is uh, this head over here is being held on by the exhaust manifold down here. Put my finger on it. It's a bolt right there. And you need an extension. And the only extension I had was a quarter inch. And you have to put a lot of torque behind the wrench. So this is what I was originally going to use. Even though, oh, I forgot to show you guys the push rods. I also put the push rods in there. Looks like a freaking cigar box. And these are rocker bolts and head bolts over there. I don't know. I organized some more things. This wasn't going to work. So I had to beef it up a little bit. We got half inch, half inch, half inch, half inch of three eighths, and three eighths, nine sixteenths. So, same setup. 
just should take a little bit more of a beating. So I'm gonna try to get this bolt off and I'll be back with you guys here in a second. Finally got the bolt out. Um, I don't really have a flash right now, but it's the bolt. Uh, you guys can kind of, oh, you, you see right there, you guys can see that little, right there, that little, uh, that's the manifold. There's another bolt somewhere, but it's blocked right there by something else. So it's gonna be a hard time finding that second bolt. It feels hard as the first bolt and we got our work cut out for us. I'm gonna try to find that other bolt, so put you guys back down. I'll be back when I find that bolt. I'm gonna stop trying with that second bolt. That second bolt's in there, it's doable. I got it probably, I don't know, I got it past the hard part. Like I broke it, I took it all the, like literally I was just about to switch over to my smaller half inch. I don't know if I told you guys that the first time I used my like, in break, I used my break over half inch for like the first part and then I'll switch over to my other half inch. I was just about to switch over, was pulling the freaking wrench down from the bolt and it wasn't coming so I just started man, like just started shaking the crap out of it and it fell right on my finger. And I got like really, so I just covered up the whole screen. But I got really pissed. Jesus, it just wouldn't stop hurting. It was pissing me off so bad. So Hunter wants me to wait for him anyway, so I'm just gonna let him do that last little bit of that bolt and then we can pull the heads because they're gonna be heavy anyways. All right, I just took off the last bolt. It's like two hours later because after I hurt my hand, I don't know if I really got that in, but I think I said something about making Hunter do the rest of the work. It ended up, ended up not being too hard, so. Now, we're gonna pull off the head and put it on this tire. All right, it's gonna be hard to record. See how, we, okay, first off, just disclaimer. We understand that the crowbar is not necessarily the nicest approach to taking this off. Okay, we actually probably should take this off. All right, well now, update, we're taking this piece of yet off. It's bracket right here for the, or the alternator. The heads are loose. Yeah, all right, so how do you wanna get this out? Very carefully. All right, well, it didn't, didn't expect anything less than that. I don't see a head gasket. What, what's up with that? Is it just, is that it? <laughs> oh yeah, that is it. Not bad. We're draining the oil though, but we're gonna try to take out the camshaft by tonight. The update? Uh, we're draining the oil right there. Oh uh, yeah, you might want to get up. It's still flowing? Yeah. Oh God, oh my Lord, it's still draining like at mock speed. Yeah, I know, you're gonna do another bucket here. Oh really? Yes. Oh, we're gonna need one like, okay, like pronto. Shit. Hey, see the one on your side? Huh? See the one on your side? Hurry, okay. No. Oh yeah, the clear one. Get, get down, lay down. Push it. Yeah! All right, ready? Yeah. Set, pull it, you gotta pull it. Wait, hold on, ready? Uh, yeah. Set, now. Oh! <laughs> That's ignorance. Oh, damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Shit. <laughs> that is ignorant. Oh. <laughs> That's ignorant. Oh my god. Yeah, it looks like a looks like a That's a lot of oil. Looks like SpongeBob. <laughs> I thought it'd be all solid. I hope it's about out. Yeah, I probably should have used that bucket in the first place. Damn it! <laughs> oh, damn it, damn it, so damn it. I, you look like a mess. <laughs> Alright, uh, you know like 20 seconds ago I said it's getting dirty in here, so we should probably like Yeah, because we've been working so much. Let's make this place a little bit less of an inconvenience. Alright, well I'm gonna an oil. I'm gonna pause so uh, okay. so we can clean up. This I'm also drying this off in our breaker wrench, and then that's all the oil. He's about to do a mean Honda pool. That's his dad's car. Chuck's got some exhaust problems, but he's gonna say he's gonna do a mean VTEC pool. That was, that was cold. He probably shouldn't have done that. He takes part. End of the episode. I am literally in the air right now, wrapping up a store. This first class, I am so new at this. Used to ride a metro, let us sit as retro. Like the infrareds on my feet, baby, let's go. Send out what they know me by, logic what they call me. Gotta catch a flight, but the fans wanna stall me. Life of a dawn, change just glowing. Always in the lab with the fresh kicks on. I'm at the MGM, rocking MCM. Bobby Socks on my arm, it's only 10 p.m. Got a rat pack with me, going ham at the hotel. Name brand, everything, fuck a wholesale.